Well, this dog up for adoption is the reason dozens are smiling daily. While she waits for a home, she's serving the Cranston community. NBC 10 Sam Reed shows us something good. Twice a month at the Cranston Senior Enrichment Center. While clients of all kinds do crafts or participate in programs, there's a pair they look forward to seeing weekly. They're well trained, they're obedient. One has a wagging tail. The therapy dogs she brings in are wonderful. The other is Sue Parker, and she's been a dog trainer for more than 20 years. There's a lot of work that goes into being a therapy dog. You just can't take any dog. Sue says when it comes to six-year-old honey, there's something special. I just love honey. <laughs> honey is up for adoption at the Cranston Animal Shelter. Honey came to us back in February. Unfortunately, the pit bull mix has been a little let down on her luck when it comes to being adopted. They just overlook her because of her size or her age. You know, a lot of animal shelters aren't seeing a lot of adoptions right now. To make the most of the four-legged friend with a larger-than-life personality, an idea came to mind. Seeing how wonderful Honey is around people, we figured she'd be great to try and see if we can make her a therapy dog at some point. Which is why for weeks, Sue has been working with Honey, who as of now is an official therapy dog. Yay! I think a lot of people hear Pitbull and they just assume, oh, you know, this, this isn't the breed for me or, you know, this isn't right for a family dog or a therapy dog. And honestly, it's further from the truth. If any dog can prove that true, it seems to be her. It's just amazing. You can go into a place, you can go into a hospital and somebody can really be sad and we'll start doing tricks. And even if we make a mistake, which we always do, um, but even when we make a mistake, people laugh. They bring us, you know, a smile. Clients here who may be elderly or disabled light up with joy while she works. Yeah. <laughs> they love touching them and interacting with them. And sometimes they call the dogs by their old pet's names, but that's perfectly okay. While Honey waits for a home, she makes everyone she comes into contact with feel like family. The people are just so happy to have a dog that will literally walk up to you and lean into you for pets and just want to be loved, and that's Honey. Showing you something good. I'm Sam Reed. Hi, everyone. It's Mark Searles from NBC10. Thanks for checking out the NBC10 WJAR YouTube channel. Click the links on your screen for more stories from across southern New England. And don't forget, hit the subscribe button below and get notified anytime we post an update on YouTube. As always, thank you for turning to 10.